Wow, welcome back to Tusca Project Fame Season 5, the biggest talent search in East Africa. Before the break, we had a chance to meet our 18 top contestants, but we also sent 12 of them straight into the academy. In fact, come to think of it, I think Sheila is chilling that side. Hello? Sheila, hey can Mitch, you hear how me? You doing? Had to leave you for a little bit, but here I am, the very first person in the Tusker Project Fame Academy, and you get to be my VIP guest. Not you, Mitch. So come on, take a look at what's in store for the contestants. Take a look at the lounge. This is where they'll be hanging out. This is where they'll be learning. This is where they'll be practicing. Maybe perhaps falling in love as well? Hmm, we'll wait and see. But it really is an electrifying atmosphere, the tension, the excitement. I know the contestants are coming in soon. I'd love to pour you a drink, but really, can you hear those footsteps? I think it's them. Contestants, is that you? having too much fun there but come to think of it we now have the judges we've also got Sheila and myself we've got the contestants there's still something missing to make this a perfect five star ah oh, yes we need the faculty ladies and gentlemen the faculty for Tusker Project fame season five Tusca Project Fame, season five. Wow, whoa. But you know what? You cannot have Tusca Project Fame without the band. Ladies and gentlemen, let's give it up for the main man behind the band, Aaron Rimbwe. And together with Aaron, we got our main man, Asaf Uzele on the bass guitar. Ladies and gentlemen, on the drums, my main man, George Mutinda. And on the electric guitar, Isaac Mukunda. And ladies and gentlemen, this time, we've got background vocalists united. Huge round of applause. All right. Okay, now, faculty, it's so good to have you guys back. Edu, how you doing, man? Good, mate. What's I up? I can see you're still smooth, man, but you missed a step, man. As usual, when you, you're supposed to, you know, kappa. That's for the end of the song. Oh, okay. You're right. You're right. Do you, do you see talent in, in this year's contestants? Are they good? Very They're good. Ready to go. Fantastic. Ha. Voice coach Kavuta. <laughs> when I see you, I want to sing. Don't hurt yourself, Mitch. Okay. Yeah. Don't quit your day job either. Okay. Yes. All right. 
It's great to see you. Good Tell to me see something. You too. Yes. The little time that you worked with these contestants, do you really think that we can have a superstar from them? Yes. Some really, really good singers, and they really want to learn, which I think is a good step. Two ingredients that you can't go wrong with. Beautiful. Yep. Great to have you back. RK. What's up, mate? Are you okay? I'm all right. <laughs> <laughs> now, you know, a lot of people have been, you know, limiting our, 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 our frame. We want a global superstar. Can we get one from these guys here? Why not? Why not? I see a lot of talents in here this year. Let's see what we can get. All right. Great. Principal Helen. Yes, did, did I bump into you in, in Paris last month? Paris? I thought it was Netherlands. We've oh, <laughs> great. Principal, yes. do you really think that these guys are teachable? Not thinking, but I know they're teachable and they got it. All right. Yes. Well, ladies and gentlemen, we have got the faculty together. We've got everybody's one big happy family. But breaking news, Tusca Project Fame Season 5 this year is going to be totally interactive. So if you're looking for a chance to get up close and personal with the judges, with myself, well, you've got so many options. You've got Twitter, you've got Facebook, you've got our website. So anytime you're looking, you can check out www.tuscalaga.com or you could check out my Twitter handle. You know, I'm extremely mature, um, but you know, my feelings also can be hurt, so please follow me instead of Ian, okay? <laughs> but if you do want to ask Ian questions like, Ian, you know I can give you some, some treatment for your hair, please send it at TPF Ian or at TPF etc. etc. So there it is, this entire season, you're gonna find us on Facebook, it's Facebook forward slash Tusca Laga. It's all going to be totally interactive. That's how we're rolling this year. So, ladies and gentlemen, before I get too personal, I like to say, don't move anywhere. Tusca Project Fame is coming back, and we've got contestants who are going to be singing after the break. Welcome back to Tusker Project Fame 5. Now, tonight we've met our top 18 contestants. We've opened up the academy and we've sent our first 12 inside, leaving us, of course, with only six contestants. Remember, there are only three spots that are left in the Tusker Academy. Now, three contestants will impress the judges after they sing and will join the 12 in the Tusker Academy. And as for the remaining three, we'll send them straight back home. But how did the six end up on probation in the first place? Take a look. Hello, isn't me you're looking for? Minutes after they took I from the bottomless beat. Why do you come here when you know I got troubles enough? I can kiss away the pain. Close your eyes, you will realize All those people were telling you lies My soul has returned, so I call the last and die Congratulations, you are not eliminated But you're all on probation Off you go So that explains why the six are on probation and we're ready for our first performer, Ugandan Brian Lazinda. You know, anytime you can be on probation, so I have the strength. Even if any, any other time I go on probation, I won't feel so bad. I'm looking at, um, at, at, giving them, at giving them my best, my performance, and my vocal. Ladies and gentlemen, performing Neo's monster hit, So Sick, make some noise for Brian. Could I change my answering machine now that I'm alone? Right now it says that we 
come to the phone And I know it makes no sense Cause you walked out the door But it's the only way I hear your voice anymore So sick of the love songs So tired of tears So down with the wishing You were still here Said I'm so sick of the love songs So sad and so low why can't I turn off the radio? kicks off the night's performances with So Sick, originally done by Neo. Well done, Brian. Let's go straight to the judges, find out whether they're impressed. Let's start with you, Judge Gerard. Uh, I think it was a nice performance, good voice, and I like the fact that he's fashion forward. Thank you. <laughs> All right. Going over to Judge Hermes, your comments, please. Yes, I, I think I like the way you look, but at some point I feel like you could have done more because you could have engaged the crowd but it wasn't a bad choice of a song. But at the same time, I feel you could have done a bit more with it, because I think you're very strong vocally, but I didn't see that tonight, but, tonight, but that wasn't a bad performance. Thank you. All right, let's go over to Judge Juliana. What did you think? Brian, I think it was a good start uh, to the show, um, but I noticed that when you came out of uh, backstage, you, you engaged the crowd, but then when you got into the song, you sort of forgot about the crowd and just started singing to yourself. And I also feel like, when you get to the high notes, you're afraid to let it out. You have a great voice. Let it out. Okay. Yeah. All right. And finally, Judge Ian. You're singing because you're on probation. Your going home depends on what you do, rather what you did. And if that is all you had, because I could feel you were holding back, you didn't give 100%. Was that good enough? We're going to let Brian answer that question. Do you think it was good enough? Was it 100%? Well, I think it wasn't 100%, but I did my best. All right. You're confident about your performance? Yes, yes, I am. OK. We're going to take a quick look at the faculty and find out what they thought, starting with Principal Helen. Brian, this is the first time you're performing in front of a crowd. For me, I think you gave it your best. I like the way you connected with the crowd. I like the way you used the stage and your range, phenomenal. Keep it up. Thank you. Right. Coach RK. For a first timer, I think you did a good job, really. The fact that you've never been in front of the crowd ever in your life, this is the first time, that's wonderful. Thank you so much. All right. So far, not too bad. He is our first contestant on stage. We're ready for the next one, so we're going to make like Jay and move on to the next one. Yep, that's my job, Sheila. Ladies and gentlemen, I'd like you to welcome from Kenya, Doreen Mushiri. I chose Rice by Gabriel uh, because she sounds so much like me, so I thought that that's my range. It's a song I can do. I'm not ready to go home just yet, so um, I'll just give it my best shot. Yeah, and just hope that it makes me stay. Ladies and gentlemen, doing the monster hit by Gabrielle Rice. Let's give it up for Doreen Mushiri. Get off. 
over you. So look at my life, look at my heart. I have seen them fall apart. Now I'm ready. <laughs> Yo, go Doreen. You, 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 you know, Doreen, I want to dedicate that song to all those people who are heartbroken tonight. <laughs> huh? Because you can rise. The world is not going to end. Judge Gerard, what do you think about her performance? She's clearly a belter. <laughs> all right. Judge Hermes, why you say? Hey, Doreen, what's up? Hi. How are you feeling? Great. That, that was a very good performance for, for a beginner, I would say. Because when you started, you were actually a bit nervous. But when you got into the song, you let it go. And that was it. Great performance. Thank you. Juliana. Doreen, um, I have to tell you something. The first time I heard you, I fell in love with your voice. Because it's unique. You have that unique tone. And I just wish you could use it a little more. I love your voice. And I think this is where you're supposed to be. Thank you. Yeah. That's what Juliana tells me all the time. Hmm? <laughs> yeah. Judge Ian, what do you think about the performance? Hmm? Seriously? Oh, come on. Much yeah. better. Will you give me a chance to speak, or do I just keep quiet? <laughs> On a serious note, a lot better than your audition song. Thank you. Yeah, yeah. well, uh, I got to tell you, babe. Yeah, you're on the right road, huh? Let's find, let's find out what Coach Edu thought. Edu, I know this wasn't a song where you could pull Running Man and could do Lingala strokes, but how did she do? She did well. Just uh, the way she came in, the way she used the stage, I think everything was well placed, and the confidence was there. Fantastic. Great job, Doreen. Great job. Good luck. All right. Sheila, what's up? I'm hanging out in the lounge with the remaining contestants. We've only just started our performances. But remember, you can interact with us online. The show goes on online as well. You can find us on Facebook. That's facebook.com forward slash Tosca Lager. Or you can send us a question, a hello, a what's up to Twitter. Our Twitter handle is at Tosca Lager. By the way, there's one that's come through from a lady called Claire. Hey, Claire, thank you very much for tuning in and watching. And you say you really miss Dr. Mitch. He's here. <laughs> Now I'm not going to hear the end of that. Thank you very much, Claire. We're going to take a short break, but when we come back, singing for survival will be Linnaeus and Diana. Don't you dare go too far away. Oh, not a superstar. 